ಸೃಷೇ Hi there, this is Nia Nau, and I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to our feel-good inspirational message of the week. Today I want to talk to you about breathing, mm, the power of breath. Yo, this is truly the doorway to you connecting with the all that is, with your inner being. It is a tool that you can use to um, become calm, to release stress and anxiety, and It is a tool that you can use to become more healthy. Um, and this tool is for free. This is something that you can apply in every area of your life and take it to the next level, to the next level. I tell you, sportsmen that knows how to um, breathe, go to the next level. And in, in, in our uh, Navy SEALs, they use breathing. breath work to become calm under um, under very stressful situations so your breath is really something that can take your life and whatever you do to the next level and this excites me so much I have been focusing um, on my breathing and uh, learning a lot more about breath work and it's such an exciting journey and I want to just share a couple of things that I've learned that might help you um, get your life to the next level so here is something I want to share with you we all breathe yeah it's like let's take a deep breath in <sighs> it's so easy to breathe we think it's so easy but some of us you know when when life becomes um, very difficult we, we we almost stop breathing we almost hold our breath some of us control our breathing I don't know how easy it is for you to just take a deep breath in and just let it go take a deep breath in and just let it go just this simple technique is what you can apply to teach you how to just let go letting go not controlling and you'll notice when you take that in breath this is a controlled breath when you release it this is you just letting it go letting go of all ideas and and concepts and opinions of yourself and stress and worry just letting it all go breathing in just let it all go and if you do this for about five minutes you'll feel how you every part of your body is just relaxing becoming calm and this is when you're opening the the flood gates for health and well-being to to flow in for you now there's two kinds of breathing conscious breathing and awareness breathing conscious breathing is you doing the breath awareness breathing is you allowing the breath to breathe you so conscious breathing is when you are actually controlling your breathing you By focusing, I'm going to breathe in now. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Conscious breathing. Now, let's look at awareness breathing. Awareness breathing is when you become very still and you are listening. You are the observer. You are witnessing your breathing. You are witnessing and observing how you are being breathed by the all that is, by something that's much bigger than you. You are just listening to your, to, to your breath and to how you are being breathed. What a powerful release and a letting go and a surrendering to the all that is when you are just listening and feeling and becoming aware of your breath. When you focus on breathing, on it here it comes into my nose gently and feel it going into the sinuses down the throat and into your lungs and you're just listening and you're just becoming aware and you're just allowing the breath to take you where it needs to take you where it wants to take you completely releasing all control all desire to control this breath and And just letting it breathe you what a powerful meditation if you can sit for 10 to 15 minutes just being in awareness of your breath and just allowing the all that is to breathe you 
very, very powerful meditation. Conscious breathing, if we do a couple of conscious um, um, in-breaths, breathing in through the nose, letting it go. And you can even control the out-breath, breathing in through the nose. Controlling the out-breath. Such powerful little tools we can use. And now the body is getting so much oxygen. You are becoming calm. Your vagus nerve is being stimulated. It's relaxing from all the oxygen and the slow, deep breaths that you take in and out. Such a powerful tool to also still the mind. Now your mind, yo. If you try and control your mind, good luck with that. It can take you all over the place. But if you use your breath to just manage the mind, now this is the goal. The goal is to, to just manage the mind. I want you to imagine the mind being like a like an untrained dog. And and you know, this dog loves its bone and your mind obviously loves a problem this is why the mind is there this is the, the purpose of the mind to solve problems but if you have an untrained mind all it wants to do is create problems to solve problems create problems to solve problems so this is why it's important for us to train and manage our thinking our minds and breath work is a powerful to you tool that we can use to to manage our mind you know if you're just doing awareness breathe, breathing you're just listening to your breathing you give the mind a little bit of a break um, conscious breathing it's focused breathing so you're also giving the mind just a little bit of break because you are focusing on something um, so this dog who wants its bone, which is now obviously this problem that it wants to solve. Have you ever tried to take a, a, a bone from a dog? It will attack you. It wants to hold on to its problem. <laughs> and if you're walking an untrained dog, it wants to pull you in every direction. You know, any little distraction will, will pull the dog in that direction. And you'll be all over the place. Imagine. Imagine just going this way and that way and this way and this and that way with your mind being all over the place. But if we control um, our breathing and focus on our breathing, we can learn to manage the mind more effectively. The idea is to just listen. And I want to encourage you to do a couple of breath work exercises. The first exercise, just awareness breathing, just listening to the breathing. Just becoming aware of how you are being breathed by the all that is, by this inner being that's within you, that always supports you, always gives to you unconditionally. Just allow yourself to relax into the knowing that you are being breathed. And then you can alternate it with some conscious breathing where you focus on taking deep breaths in. And you can do this in and out through your mouth or in and out through your nose doesn't matter whatever feels um, uh, it, whatever happens for you naturally just go with that you can do a couple of fast breathings like <laughs> through the mouth <sighs> you can do it deeper <sighs> and feel how you are being flooded with oxygen and when your um, senses is becoming a bit overwhelmed just sit with that feeling just be with it and then just breathe through it, breathe through it. Play with your breath. Play with this and you'll feel how it will take you to the most peaceful place within you where you can then find the courage for what you need to do, for the changes you need to make in your life. Uh, your, your breathing can help you heal your body, heal your mind. Um, so my friends, I really want to encourage you to apply some conscious and some awareness breathwork into your life. Just give this a go. Try for a little bit and see how effective this is. Um, I will do some more um, breathwork podcasts um, later on where we can go more into depth of how breath can absolutely change your life. So go on, have some, take some deep breaths and play with your breath and just become aware of how you are being breathed by the all that is my friend 
Thank you for taking the time to listen. Remember, you are beautiful, you are magnificent, and you are so, so loved. And let the God